One of the most recent developments in tank design is the Cadillac Gauge Commando Stingray. This is entirely a private venture for export only, and it's already in production for the Royal Thai Army, with many more orders expected. In general appearance, it greatly resembles the Vickers FMC VMF-5, and it shares many similar characteristics. The gun, however, is a brand new, low-recoil version of the standard 105mm L7 weapon developed by Royal Ordnance in Britain. This is an important factor in a vehicle which only weighs 20 tons. Although the Stingray is only lightly armored, its hull and turret design give excellent shot deflection qualities. The gun can fire the whole range of NATO 105mm ammunition, including the latest fin-stabilized discarding Sabot round, which is capable of killing any known tank. The gun is also fully stabilized in both elevation and azimuth, and being fitted with a laser rangefinder, passive night vision sights, and a completely integrated digital fire control system is extremely accurate. The main gun can elevate to a maximum of 18 degrees and depress to 7.5 degrees, while the turret can traverse through a full circle in just nine seconds. In case of a power failure, the turret can also be cranked round by hand. Eight rounds of ready-use ammunition are carried in the turret, and a further 28 in a stowage locker. There is a coaxial 7.62 millimeter machine gun, and either a second 7.62 millimeter or a 50 caliber machine gun can be mounted on the turret roof. Stingray is fully air portable and can be carried in the C-130 Hercules, which is the Western world's standard military transport. Despite its small size, the interior is remarkably spacious, adding to the crew's comfort and efficiency. The tank is powered by a 535 horsepower V8 diesel engine and has a four-speed automatic transmission. This gives an extremely high power to weight ratio and gives Stingray a top speed of over 40 miles per hour. Qualities of agility in a hard-hitting gun make this very cost-effective light tank an extremely attractive proposition for smaller countries.